So, the Crystal Princess and the Brindledown Prince went to live in a land full of laughter. In the Brindledown Castle with crystalline walls. And happy they lived ever after. Is that one still your favourite, Rach? But it only happens in fairy tales. Jess is right, we've got to stick together for her sake. Oh, it was crazy to say yes. Yeah, if it was just him and me, we could sleep rough, stay in squats and all that. But a little kid needs a roof over their head. Warm bed, regular meals. How long's 1400 bucks gonna last? But if we don't do it, well, tomorrow. She'll be a teenager when I get out. She'll hardly know me. Yeah, sure, we'll have weekend visits. That'll get to be a chore for her in the end. Probably rather go out with her friends. If she's got any. She'll get teased at school because her mum's in jail. She'll resent me for it. By the time I get out, we'll be strangers. Yeah, we've got to do it. There's no other way. Oh, I can't believe Jess is prepared to give it all up. Everything he's got over the last few years. Just going to chuck it all in for me. No, I, I really appreciate you taking mine as a partner, mate. Ah, uh, it's us who should be thanking for that. She nagged me into it. Not that I got any regrets at this stage. <laughs> now, you gave me a chance when no one else did, mate, and I really appreciate that. Yeah, well, give us a decent Christmas present or something, eh? <laughs> He's worked so hard to be his own boss. We're Michael Bannister and Susan Knight. We just make it up as we go along. Then we have to remember the lies so we don't get caught. What if we run into someone we know? This is never going to work. Yo. Oh, g'day. Just came around to pay you the rent. Well, this is a first. It's not due for a couple of days. Well, if it's in my pocket, I'm liable to spend it. <laughs> Tough. Hey, look, I was going to say, uh, if there are any hassles, you know, after next week, you know, when you're up for childcare fees. Oh, it's cool. It's cool. Well, thanks anyway. If you're a strap for cash, you know. Well, Ralph thinks we're going to be millionaires in a few years. <laughs> he probably is. Have you got a couple of beers in the fridge? Sure, help yourself. Great. Not for me, though. Oh. Go on. For old time's sake. <laughs> that sounds like we haven't seen each other for years. I was actually just talking to Lockie, and uh, I was talking about how you and me and him used to live in the house together. That was good times. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it was good. You know, I really like summer, baby. You know? I mean, I know you don't sort of feel that way because you've been living here all your life and stuff, but I mean, when you come from the city and all the pollution, you really appreciate a place like this. No. Yeah. You know, I've really changed a lot since I've been here. And I've had some wicked times. Well, here's plenty more to come, eh? Yeah, let's hope so. None of this would have happened if Dad hadn't got in the way. I wouldn't have got involved with anyone else. And I wouldn't be in such a mess. If only, if only. Not too late now. Now we've got to throw everything away and start from scratch. It's no big deal for me. Jesse's got such a lot going for him here. Where are we going? We're going on a surprise holiday. It's going to be heaps of fun. See you out there. I'll see you out there, yeah. Yeah. Let's 
do it. You know, the uh, Brindledown Castle with the crystal on walls. I'm happy we're going to live, but forever after. Oh, hi, Terry. Come in. Hi. Sorry to interrupt. Um, Trevor, could I borrow the keys to your place? What for? Well, Carly didn't turn up to court this morning. Well, I didn't think she was due to appear for another week or so. No, it was brought forward. Look, the place looks deserted. It's all shut up. Well, they wouldn't have shot through. Wouldn't they? For their sakes, I hope you're right. You stay on the balcony with Howard and I'll take you outside in two ticks. Hey. Oh, <laughs> Great. I'd give you the job. Yeah. Nervous? Oh, I haven't really been for a job interview for ages. We'll be fine. Cool. I'm going to catch the train, OK? I don't want to get there and not be able to find a park. I do. I'll be a guy, I guess. See ya. Good luck. Good luck's my middle name. Sweet. Show me where you hurt yourself. <gasps> Better get you to a doctor. My little girl's had an accident. I was taken to the doctor. Been in the wars, eh? Trust your license, please. 